What's up? You like cookies? Cause it's time for another freak eating review. Today, I have in front of me this brand new Chips Ahoy Oreo cream filled cookie. I think that's kind of the new thing. Every company takes like a pre-existing product and then stuffs it with another product. I know Oreo, Oreo is doing like their own Reese's peanut butter cup filled cookies. Chips Ahoy has like a frosting filled one, birthday cake frosting. They have an M&M's filled one. And now why not? I mean, Oreo cream is basically like, you know, crack. It's basically like sugar crack inside of a cookie. And I thought Chips Ahoy Chewy were already kind of like crack anyway, so this is like the best of both worlds. I won't name names, but somebody has already opened this cookie package and has already, you know, feasted on about half of it. I won't name names, but it may or may not rhyme with John. So, let's see. It's a chewy cookie. It's also a small cookie, which is typically what a chewy Chips Ahoy looks like. I think if you were to go through these really fast, you might not even notice there was cream filling inside. It's pretty subtle. Like I was expecting more of like a more of like an explosion. I guess I'm more used to an Oreo where there's like two discs and cream inside. It's good. Like I think if you actually slow down to enjoy your cookie, you're gonna notice that little cream filling in there. Don't take my word for it, but I think this would be these would be really good if you microwave them. Seriously. I think it's got to be done. Like, somebody's got to take this and just create a giant pile of cookies and just microwave the whole thing. So you'd have this, like, totally, like, soft, runny, gooey, chocolatey mess. If I had to give these a grade, make it an A. It's just really, really sugary. I don't know if these are going to be on the market for too long though, because when you think about it, Chips Ahoy already makes like six major varieties of cookie, and Oreo's got their own game nailed. This crossover thing is really awesome though, and of course it's made possible by the fact that both products are made by Nabisco. If you're interested, I suggest you run out to the market and buy five. It's just, it's, it's a really, really sweet cookie. The Chips Ahoy Chewy were my favorite anyway, and I was already partial to the Reese's, the Chips Ahoy with Reese's. So we have Reese's with Oreo and Reese's with the Chips Ahoy, which is diabetes in the making. The main reason I went out to get these was I saw a video with the Deadly Sins where Paul did a challenge where he tried to eat an entire one of these packages. The cookies themselves are actually really good. I keep saying that. It's, it's just genius, but it just seems so stupid that we keep seeing these crossovers. I mean, how about something really original or, or stick to your brand? Thank you for watching another episode of Freak Eating Review. Until next time, stay in school. Don't do drugs and eat like a freak. I think it's grapefruit time. Let the contest begin! If it's summertime... You can bet your soy sauce that the Nisei Festival is going to be hosting its yearly Gyoza Eating Championship. The action in 2013 was almost as hot as the Gyoza themselves, 